Oh, big boy! You gonna try to take some steps? Sunday for us and it's a busy day a lot's going on lately first of all Bailey was at school on Friday and swung her hand like this and ran into a desk and she now is in a cast it's debatable whether or not it is broken she went to an urgent care and the urgent care did an x-ray they thought they saw a fracture they sent the imaging to a hospital who was like mm, I don't see a fracture, go to a hand specialist. We went to the hand specialist. The hand specialist said, I don't see a fracture, but this is how I want to proceed because it's possible that there's a fracture or that it might need casting, but we'll only do it for two weeks. So the good news is that hopefully the cast will come off in two weeks, but right now it's there. Then after that, Jacob went to gymnastics and fell funny and now his chest hurts really badly. I think a rib like maybe disconnected from cartilage. I I think that's my guess. I talked with the pediatrician. He was like, yeah, you just got to rest it. And that's what his coach said as well. So that was all Friday. <laughs> so we are recovering from all of that. And, and all of the rest of life is happening too. So it's a lot. Also, Rue got spayed. So Rue is a large dog and we wanted to um, do our best by her physically. And there's some discussion right now in like the dog professional community that um, delaying a spay past their first heat is ideal for those larger dogs. So I guess I'm not a professional, this is not my expertise, but from what I've read, um, when you do a spay very early in a large dog's life, their growth hormones no longer know when to stop. Then they grow a lot in certain ways and their joints can't handle it and they can develop issues with like their hips and stuff. So, and then the other side of it is that spaying your dog is really good, especially if you're not a breeder or planning to breed your dog, which we're not. But spaying can help keep your dog safe against certain cancers and things like that. So spaying is like really important, um, not just to make sure that the dog population isn't, you know, ever growing, but also for the health and safety of your dog. She got spayed about four or five days ago and she's mostly just been kind of chill. Um, she hasn't tried to eat at her stitches, but some dogs do and we don't know if like it's possible that she might all of a sudden like start to itch or something and like lick at her stitches. So to keep her as safe as we can, we put her in something called a surge suit and it's adorable. <laughs> it, this is instead of a cone, but it's the same, it's to meet the same need. So I'll show you right now, she's so cute. You little baby bear. This spot here is shaved because that's where they placed her IV when they sedated her for her surgery. She has her little outfit, she's looking good. You doing okay, little angel? Yeah, you just rest, sweetie bear. So what are you guys playing? Marvel Splinter. Fun. Fun, I see it You wanna play Marvel Splinter? <laughs> oh, with a blanket on top. With a, is Rue playing? Rue's like, don't bring me into this. Hi, Rue. You've got Rue watching. So Bailey, I just really briefly talked about your arm. Do you want to tell the story? Because you were the one there. I, I didn't I'll just bang my hand into a desk. <laughs> is there any more to it? Not really. Not really. How has the experience been so far? <laughs> yeah. Pain. Pain. Do you think that it's broken? Yeah, fractured. Yeah. I just keep hoping we'll have like a week where you don't have a broken kid, but. <gasps> I've never broken a bone. <laughs> yeah, it's great success, never breaking bones. <laughs> and by the way, I feel like when Jacob broke something most recently, a lot of people were like, get his levels checked and his nutrition checked because like maybe they're deficient in something. I did, because I was like, what is going on? And I talked to their pediatrician and he was like, no, they're fine, this is just like life. So, this is just the state of life we're in, I guess. Huh. It's funny, because I feel like Parker is the one who does the most crazy things. It's so true! And he has not broken a bone at all. <laughs> it is 
completely true. And Jacob is so cautious. Like he's like, I just don't want to break a bone. All I want to do is not break a bone. I'm like, no, it'll be fine, honey. And then he breaks bone. Did we explain? We explained that how it happened at gymnastics, right? Yeah. Like Jacob went all summer with a cast on his wrist, and then he waited like three weeks, I think, after the cast came off, because he was like, I just need to be strong before I do anything. And then we were like, no, you're, you're fine, you're good. He went to gymnastics camp. Within 30 minutes, I got a call that he had tripped over, like trying to avoid a small child while like playing, what were they playing? Sharks and minnows. Sharks and minnows. He wasn't even doing gymnastics. He was doing sharks and minnows. We, we tend to break bones. But I've broken both my hands. <laughs> Bailey's broken both her hands. I've broken my leg. We tend to break bones like walking through a classroom or making a bed. That's <laughs> how I broke one of my yeah, bones. Yeah, Christopher broke his finger. So it's not that we're it's not we're like we're being dangerous. It runs in we're the family. We're just like doing things. Yeah, and, and uh, apparently, according to doctors, our bones are okay. It's just we're kind of fussy, I think. Oh yeah, yeah. I yeah. definitely am very fussy. So. Yeah. Do you have a balloon? How's the game going, Parker? Good. I think I'm winning. I'm not very sure. I'm just getting random cards. Oh, big boy! Wow. What was that, Parker? I said jumping before he's walking. Jumping before he's walking. You want a balloon? It's blueberries. It's blueberries? Yeah. Is that what you want to talk about today? Blueberries today. Blueberries today. It's blueberries, blackberries. Blueberries and blackberries for sure. So I wanted to talk to you a little bit about. Oh. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> what do you want to do for your birthday? You're turning three soon. Birthday. Do you want a theme for your birthday? Like Spider-Man or dinosaurs? Like what do you want your birthday to be decorated like? Blue dinosaurs. Blue dinosaurs? Hey! Yeah, I love blue dinosaurs. <laughs> Is there any sort of food you want at your birthday? Blueberry today. Blueberry. Do you want your whole birthday to be about blueberries? Yeah. <laughs> or do you want blueberries? It's oh, oh blueberries. don't touch that. Yeah. It's blueberry today. Blackberries today. Okay. It's blackberries today. So blackberries on your birthday and blueberries on your birthday. Yeah. Do you want any special presents for your birthday? Yeah. Okay. What kind of presents do you want? Blue presents. Blue presents. It's, what's your favorite color? Red. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> yeah, bananas. I can with what? With it's bananas. With bananas. Okay. Okay. Avocados. Avocados. Yeah. Okay, so for your birthday, you avocados. want avocados. You want avocados, bananas, blueberries, blackberries, a blue dinosaur. Blue dinosaur. Are you, are you still want the blue dinosaur or not so much? Just blueberries. Um, this is much. Not so much. At home. At home. You want it at home? Yeah. Yeah. Do you want Do you want your birthday to be here at the house, or do you want to go do a pool party? Pool party. Pool party with blueberries. Uh -huh. That sounds fun. Ah! <laughs> Is Parker doing gymnastics? Oh, fancy gymnastics, buddies. <laughs> yeah. Is that room? Be gentle with her. She has ouchies. So. Teddy and I are gonna head outside because the card game got set up on the ground while he was at nap, which is fine when he's at nap, but when he's awake and wanting to crawl everywhere and grab everything and eat everything, it doesn't work out so well. So let's go check out the swing, see if it's available.
Well, it's that time of the week where we need to go grocery shopping and I am going out, just me and Teddy today, which I'm actually kind of excited about. It's fun to have one-on-one -on -one time with the kids. As a parent of, yeah, are you excited? As a parent of six children, uh, I really do try and find time for each one individually. And I, I'm always really aware of like making sure that each kid gets you know the the proper amount of attention and making and checking in with them making sure everything's cool so i'm excited about this time with teddy right now at the store just him and me it's gonna be fun i know that uh luke's in nap right now and jessica's playing a board game with some of the other kids so we're all doing various things right now but i'm going to the store and duncan actually has a cooking class today i need to get some ingredients for that so won't you join me and teddy as we go to the store. Jessica and I have been using the Shared Notes app for pretty much everything these days. So I have a shopping list on my phone that we can both edit and look at. Yeah. 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 Sparkle water's on the list. You like the store? Yeah. Store? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You found some holes. Are you checking the list? Yeah. Yeah? What, what else is on the list? Okay. Can I, have, can I have my phone back, please? Thank you. Come on over. Don't be scared. What do you think of that? Here while I sing you a little tune about my... Ribcage. I'm falling through you. Look at all the Halloween stuff. Look at all this. We got buckets. We got. Oh, this is cool. Non candy treats for trick or treat. I like that. I like a non candy option. I like candy too, but a non candy option is good. I like it. I always appreciate that. Spider. Can you say spider? Hi. Hi. Hi, spider. That's a spider next to you. Is that your new pet? Does it have eyes? How's the price? Good price? Look what I found wrapping paper with blue dinosaurs on it. It's also got purple and green dinosaurs, but blue dinosaurs. I gotta get this. I gotta get this for Luke for his birthday. What do you think? Would he like that? Yeah? Yeah? You wanna hold it? Yeah. There you go. Thank you. Be careful with it. Don't bend it. Duncan's all set up for his class. You ready? Dunk the make. Is that your slogan? No, um. Dunk the make? You know how Jacob does Jacob the make? He does Chef Jacob, Chef or he did when he was Jacob. when he was your age. Chef Jacob. I mean, Luke Chef knows Duncan. all about it. I mean, blueberries. Chef Duncan. And blueberries? I'm gonna be Chef Duncan. You're today. Chef Duncan? Class is starting right now, so let's get signed in. What are you making tonight? You're making pizza? It's turning to be dough.
Are you making some pizza toadstools as well? Yeah. Yeah? You got a little butter knife there? Up this one. Yeah? Are you going to cut out the toadstool? Mm-hmm. Oh, Ooh. I got it. Just like your big brother. And this is tray number two. Nice. Getting good and saucy. Here's the final product. Aren't they cute? They're little mushrooms, little toadstools that are actually little pizzas. Very clever. Oh, who wants a toadstool pizza? Is it you? Are you the one that wants one? Is it good? What do you say to Duncan? It's good? You liked it? How did Duncan do, Jake? Good? Tastes good? Does it taste like a mushroom? It does? It doesn't? It tastes delicious. Should we give one to Teddy? Yeah. Tastes like a pizza with like a little bit of, what is this, rosemary? I think the crust is actually made with uh, Italian seasoning. Oh. So it's like infused into the crust. Do you like it, Teddy? Is it yummy? This is my toadstool. Mmm. I feel like I should be two times bigger like Super Mario when he has a toadstool. That's what happens in Super Mario's, right? I forget. It's been a very long time. Hi. Let's talk about what we learned today. We learned that while Parker is able to participate in daring stunts, the rest of us need to avoid hazardous activities, like swinging our arms in a classroom or making a bed. We learned that Luke likes everything in his life to be blue because his favorite color is red. And finally, we learned how to stay organized with your spouse by using shared notes. We also learned how those notes can get misplaced. Thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you next time. <laughs>